Hi, and welcome to StampingSmiles.com. I'm Shelly Godby, the owner and CEO of Stamping Smiles, and today I'm going to demonstrate for you my July customer thank you card with the Flower Shop stamp set and the coordinating Stamping Smiles Pansy Punch. <laughs> That's the unofficial name. <laughs> so come and see the card that you'll get when you place your July 2013 stamp up order with me. So here we have the Flower Shop stamp set and the coordinating Pansy Punch, and the Pansy Punch will punch out all of the flowers here of different styles and personalities. I chose this whimsical one for my July customer thank you card, and this is in clear amount. And so we're just going to take this out, clear block C, and I want to quickly show you um, one fun element to my card. And so I have some Whisper White cardstock, pistachio pudding, classic Stampin' Pad. This is the new 2013-2015 M color. So yummy. All of these colors. And so I have the Firm Foam pad so, pad, so I don't need to press hard on the pad to get a lovely image. And then I'm going to change colors. So I need my Stampin' Scrub and Stampin' Mist. And I clean on this side, squirt some Stampin' Mist. This cleans and conditions my stamps. Come over here and dry it off. Now I am ready to either store it away or, or change colors. And I'm changing colors to the Coastal Cabana, and this is one of the 2013-2015 in colors, too. And ink this up. Now I'm just going to rotate a little bit and stamp right over top of it. How cute is that? And so then with the Pansy Punch, just put that in and punch it out. And we've got this two-tone. And that the Coastal Cabana will um, lighten up when it dries. And there we have our cute little flower. So next I'm going to show you the finished card. So here we are with my finished July customer thank you card. It's simple, but I really am pleased with it. Uh, here's that element that we just did, our pansy punch with the two flowers stamped over each other. And see, it did calm down. And our base of our card is pistachio pudding. And we created our own background paper with using that same stamp in the two colors randomly all over. And here we have a 3-inch three inch, three inch circle. I die cut with a 3-inch circle uh, originals die. But you also could use the Circles Collection Framelits dies. And there's one that's 3 and an eighth, and that really wouldn't make any difference at all, that eighth inch. And, uh, and then embossed it because it was looking a little bit plain. I tried stamping the blue, you know, the Coastal Cabana on the Coastal Cabana. It was okay, but it was just getting a little bit busy. But it was just too plain not to have something, so with a square lattice embossing folder, didn't that liven it up? And uh, the flower needed something in the center, so I used uh, baked brown sugar. I punched that out with the Owl Builder Punch, got my circle there, it was just the right size, and then stamped my greeting from the Sweet Essentials stamp set in the baked brown sugar. And, uh, and then a little bit of a brown touch there. It just added uh, some nice contrast, and it worked really well. And, of course, we have our little something-something inside. And you could have, I could have chosen pistachio pudding, but I thought I liked the contrast of the Coastal Cabana and did the same thing on my envelope. So there we go, my July customer thank you card. Now this is going to be uh, quick and easy to do, which you need if you're going to make a lot, but it's also attractive even if you're not making a lot. We like cards that are fast yet fabulous. <laughs> and so there we have it. Um, and so you know what too, when you purchase a flower shop and stamp set in either clear mount or wood mount with the pansy punch in the flower in the flower shop bundle, you're going to get a 15% discount. So when you're looking through your Stampin' Up! catalog, if there's something that's new to the catalog and it has a coordinating accessory, like an embossing folder, a punch, or framelits, look for the triangle box, not triangle, rectangle box, and it may be on the opposite page that lets you know about the bundle, because you will need to put in the bundle number. Don't put those two things in separately. Use the bundle number to get that 15% discount. Okay, so Flower Shop Stamp Set Pansy Punch Bundle and Everybody needs to have a pansy punch because, as we know, it's the actually Stamping Smiles pansy punch. They just didn't want to show that kind of favoritism by printing it in the book. <laughs> so um, this card will show up in your mailbox when you place your July Stampin' Up! order with me in my online store, www.shopwithshelly.com. And uh, there you go. You have it. I'm Shelly Godby, teaching you how to create hand stamp smiles. Thanks for watching.